What's going on you guys? It's been way, way too long. Thought I better get in here and catch up and see what you guys are up to. Who watched the Academy Awards last night? Did you like the uh, winners? I was, my favorite movie of the year was uh, Julie and Julia. And I was hoping that uh, that would win. Of course it wasn't even nominated. And I was hoping that Meryl Streep would win for uh, her role that she played as uh, Julia Child. But she didn't. I guess she was a close runner up. But overall I thought it was pretty good. Um, I was happy that Monique won for her um, role in the movie Precious, and happy to see that Jeff Bridges won for his role as uh, in uh, Crazy Heart. I, I saw that movie last week, really enjoyed that, so love going to the movies. Um, I'm not, not a very good critic, but I uh, love going to the movies and sitting back in the back and just taking it in. I see a lot of movies every year, and so I was kind of looking forward to the uh, Academy Awards this year was actually happy that Avatar didn't win Best Picture. I liked Avatar okay, but it's you know, not really my kind of film, and um, I kind of like for the old-fashioned movies to win, you know, the ones with traditional settings and uh, real actors, not not animated stuff or computer-generated stuff. But anyway, I'm not, not trying to knock Avatar, but I just didn't want it to win everything, you know what I mean? Let's see what it's, what's going on. I, I think the last time I was on, I showed you my new little dog that I'd gotten from some friends. She wandered up on the, the porch where they live, south of town, and just wouldn't leave and went out of our way to find who she belonged to. Ran ads in the paper and put signs all over the neighborhood and went on all the lost and found dog bulletin boards and just never could find their owner. I don't know. I can't imagine what happened. Maybe. You know, maybe because of the economy, someone just put her out on the street. I don't know. But anyway, she is absolutely, absolutely the sweetest dog I've ever seen, and I've had a lot of fun with her. I think the last time I told you, I was getting ready to take her to get her groomed, and tried to, and then I realized she had to have her shots, and so I screwed around. And oh, a few weeks back, I finally got her to the vet. It's been a fortune, it's like having a child, I guess. It's I had to do all sorts of all the blood work and the test, and but everything checked out. She's completely healthy. I think she's like between eight and eight and ten years old, so she's an older dog, but um, but she's in good health. Um, then I took her over to the groomer, and uh, so let me show you. I'll, I'm sticking in here the the before and after photos. So her hair was all matted up when I got her. I guess she'd been out wandering around a lot and just not had been maintained with that long hair. Was, I guess the hair was like eight inches long, so it was a mess. So they just had to kind of take it all the way down. But I think that's going to be good for the summer because. Um, she loves cold weather and she gets like today it's it's so oh gosh it's like i think up in the uh, around 70 and she got outside and just laid down it was too hot for her even with the short hair so but anyway gosh i don't know a whole lot i've been uh one reason i haven't been around much i've been down in my back um every about once a year i have a little bit of lower back pain the last a couple days two or three days and goes away well I guess I'm getting old. This year didn't go away. And I waited week after week after week, waited like four weeks, and it just got real bad, real bad. I couldn't even walk. And I uh, so got to the chiropractor and something. We've been working, working on it and all the deep muscle stuff to get it fixed. And I am just about over. It's just barely still there, but it's, it's man, it's like 95% better. So for those of you that suffer from that stuff, I have real sympathy for you now because that, there's nothing worse. And, I'm not going to let that go again. I, just, uh, I thought it'd go away on its own and it just got worse and worse and worse. So. Anyway, let me know what's going on with you guys. I, again, I apologize like always. I, I disappeared and haven't kept up, but uh, I want to know what's happening with you guys. Mike and Beth and a couple others have sent me notes saying, hey, it's time. It's time for a video. So, And I've been after a few other people telling them, telling them that it's time. And I looked and I thought, well, you know, they've made a video since I have, so I guess I need to get on here make a video even though i don't have a lot to say and uh just uh get on and say hi hope you're all doing great hope you're having a great week and uh look forward to chatting with you and catching up talk to you later